What's up there, rock stars? Frank Calabro, Jr. I'm drinking a cup of coffee here. Gonna uh, make you guys a quick video. I'm gonna show you guys how to put a stack counter uh, so you can track your landing pages, your websites, your sales pages, whatever you want to track out there on the internet. Any of your internet real estate that you got uh, loaded up onto, uh, onto your server. Now this is a basic landing page here for my bootcamp site. And I just put this stack counter on here. And you can have this visible or invisible. You can change the size of the stack counter. You can, um, what else can you do with this thing? You can change the colors around. I'll show you how it works. But what this does is it'll count how many visitors you get to your site. But it'll also, it'll show you where your visits come from by the IP address. It'll show you like where in the world people are uh, visiting your pages from. Pretty uh, powerful tool. I've been using this for a couple years and uh, let me show you how it works real quick. All right, let's see. I think we need to go to, let's go to uh, plugins first. Now, in your, in your, uh, Wherever you have your landing pages or your sales pages, wherever you have them um, stored at, I guess, whatever uh, um, you're using, you're going to have to install a, a plugin on WordPress. You can also use this plugin to uh, put a stack counter on your websites, on your basic, your blogs. So you just go to Add New in your plugins. What you'll do is you'll type in Stack Counter. One word, stack counter, search plugins. Let's see. Yeah, it's the first one. Stack counter, real time visitor stats. I don't know when you're going to see this video, but it's 1.6.3 currently. And it's by whoever this is, somebody Cullen. That's the, uh, the author of the plugin. So this is what you want to download. Just inst uh, it's not going to let me do it because I've already got it. So just inst uh Install it and then activate it. Okay, now once you've installed this and activated it, what I want you to do is go over to stackcounter.com. You can set up an account for free and just set it up. All right, now once you're in Stack Counter, you're logged in, just click on projects and you're going to click on add project right here. Okay, now project URL, where do I want to put a counter at? I want to put a counter on this page right here. This is one of my sales pages. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab this URL up here. Come on now, there we go. Going to go and paste that in. You can title it, whatever you want to title it. Um, Okay, now this project group, you can type in what country you're in, your time zone, that kind of stuff. Uh, let's see, and here's where you customize the button. Now you can also get an email report sent to you once a week, monthly or daily, how many visits you're getting, all that kind of stuff. I don't really like these emails, so I'm gonna shut that off. But you can get that data, but I just log in back here to see, look at all the data, but you can also have it emailed to you. Now I wanna customize my counter, you can also have the counter to be invisible, meaning people can't see it, okay? It's just put on there so you can, um, you know, collect data for yourself. So you don't have to have your, your counter visible. You can have it invisible. It's totally up to you. So I want to customize this. Let me look at the page real quick. Wait a minute. I'm doing this one. Okay. I'm trying to think what color I want to have the, uh, the counter. probably just have an invisible background so background I'm just gonna uncheck it if you uncheck it you're not gonna have no background it's gonna be clear and this is gonna this says that the text color is gonna be white now I can have this visible or invisible white I don't know if I want white on this page you know for this for this purpose is just for training you guys so it doesn't really matter right now I'll just leave it alone. Then you can click the size of the counter. I'm going to click largest. 
you can adjust um you know how many digits eight digits is fine you can adjust it whatever you want to have it say uh you can separate uh the thousands by commas if you want that's fine and just click done okay basically your stack your uh counter is built all you gotta do now is click add project I'm going to click on, I'm going to scroll down, I'm going to find WordPress because I'm going to install this on WordPress. That's where I have my landing pages and my sales pages loaded. So I'm going to click on WordPress. Uh, which WordPress? Um, I don't know. I just click on this one right here. Other WordPress installation. Because I just want the code. I want the HTML code. And it says right here, you may also install the plugin manually, which is what I want to do. And here's what I want. I want the standard, this is like HTML code. I'm going to copy all that. Now, real simple. I'm going to find this page right here. What's the name of this page? Welcome to my world. We're going to go to pages. Welcome to my world. We're going to hit edit. Okay, now at the very bottom, make sure there's a, there's a tab here. You got visual and, and text. Make sure it's, the text is, uh, you click, you you got this tab right here uh, clicked. This is the HTML. Go down to the very bottom. We're going to hit enter. And we're going to paste that code in there. Paste. Then we're going to click update. Okay, we're going to refresh the page. All right, let's scroll down to the bottom, see if it worked. And there it is. There's my counter. It's right there. Now, you can have this visible or invisible. It really doesn't matter. You can change. Sorry about that. Let me shut that video off. You can change the color on this. Do whatever you want to do with it. Now, here's the cool thing about this. Let's go back over to Stack Counter. Let's hit Projects. Let's click on one of my projects. Let's click on my boot camp site. I just installed this. Now, let's see. Let's see. Recent visitors. And there's a bunch of data in here. You guys can figure all this out and read all this. Let's see here. Recent visitor map. You see right here on the left-hand side? Let's, let's zoom in just a little bit. Make this easier to see. Okay, here it is. Um, recent visitor map. Click on that. This will actually show you the IP addresses, where people are actually visiting my page from. And I just put this on here a couple minutes ago, this, uh, this counter. I just installed it a few minutes ago, right before this video. And uh, you can see where people are coming from. I mean... It gives you the actual IP address. I think it does. Yeah, it does. It, it gives you, look at all this crazy information it gives you. This person was from Canada. It even tells you their operating system. <laughs> Windows 7, they're using Chrome. It tells you, you know, the, the right down to the second when they visited your landing page. How cool is that? Now, this particular person visited my landing page from ClickSense. It also tells you where they're coming from. So if you have multiple um, um, URLs directing to this particular page, it'll show you where they're coming from. And you can move this map around. So how cool is this? This is a pretty cool free little tool called Stack Counter, and you can track your websites, track your visitors, see where all your traffic is coming from, and this is in real time. And there's a lot of other stuff you can do with this. I'm not going to get into all this. You can click on all these buttons and figure it out yourselves. But um, this is just a good way to track your websites, see where your traffic is coming from. All right. I hope you guys learned something here. You guys take care, and God bless everybody. Thank you.